happy people i'm back with another video and today i have a review of a new gel x kit that's on the market um this is actually from a canadian company and they are called fanair cosmetics and this is what their gel x kit looks like they actually reached out to me and asked me if i wanted to review their products and i said yes they are a small business they're up and coming like i said they are new to the market so i'm really excited to be able to showcase some of their products here today um so yeah i want to give a big shout out to fanair cosmetics for sponsoring today's video and let's hop right on into what is in this kit okay right off the bat you all can see that it comes with a lot of goodies so i'm gonna go ahead and open this up so we can get a closer look First off, I like the little baggie that it comes in because it'll give an easy way to store all the items in one place. Um, I review a lot of kits on my channel and so it's nice to be able to have a place to put everything and keep it all like one brand specific. I also like the fact that this bag is environmentally friendly so there's not a lot of cardboard and like unnecessary packaging. It's straight to the point, which I like. Definitely going to be reusing this bag for something else. Love that. So the name of this kit is the Diva Express Starter Kit. And so right off the bat, you all see that it comes with um, some nail tips and it comes with 600 pieces. And these are medium coffin and they are 100% soft gel. It comes in 12 sizes. And like I said, 600 pieces, which is a lot, than the, is, which is more than the average kit. The average kit comes with 500 pieces. Okay, so this is what they're looking like. I definitely love that it comes inside of a box. It makes finding your nail size a lot easier. And the box at the top has the different numbers on it, which is also nice. And so let's take a look here and see um, how these gel tips are. Okay. To me, they seem like your average um, nail tip. So that is what that looks like. And then I'm going to give you all a side profile here. And then let's see what it would look like on the natural nail. So this is a size one. I think they fit like an average nail tip would. Let me look at a size zero because that's typically what my thumbnail is. And so, yeah, these are pretty good fit. For the most part, they fit sidewall to sidewall. And I like this medium coffin shape. That's really cute. So that is what that's looking like. All right. And again, it does come with 12 different sizes, so it should be enough to fit a, a variety of nail beds, whether they're wide or narrow. The kit also comes with an alcohol prep pack. You all will definitely need this whenever you're removing the dust and debris and oil from your nails. It comes with a nail file. This one is a 100-180 grit. You can never have enough files. And this just looks like your standard zebra file. Next, we have the lamp that it comes with. So this is called the Jealous Light Lamp. And so this is what it looks like. I like that it's like small and compact. You flip the two legs out. Oh, that's big. Wow. Okay, this is a pretty cool lamp. I don't think I've seen one like this before, but it has the LED lights on the side as well as in the middle. I think all the ones I've seen small like this only have the ones on the side. And it's very spacious underneath here, so that's really nice as well. Very cool. I like that. Okay, so I think I'm supposed to peel off this blue. Yeah, I'm supposed to peel the blue off. So I will take my time going through and peeling it off for you guys. That's really nice. I like that. And the nice thing about this being metal is that it reflects. So the lights, as they're like reflecting, it's going to reflect and give more like UV power, which is really cool. This is the charging plug that it comes with. So um, it's the USB on one side and then it's the universal plug on the other. So you will just have to find like a little block to plug it in. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. All right. So it looks like the plug is right here at the back. So all you do is plug it in here. And then you'll press the power button to turn it on. And that's how you turn it on. And, and my hand fits perfectly underneath here. It's plenty of space to give. I think this is a little bit bigger than some of the average portable LED lights that come with kits like this. And I hope this doesn't blind you all, but that is how many lights you get in it. It comes with 12 LED lamps. Like that's, that's amazing. That's awesome. I love that. I did check on the website. It didn't exactly say what the wattage was, but it did say that it had the 12 LED lights and that it had a 60 second and 120 second timer, which is really nice. Um, so that is the lamp here. And then these last items here, which I'm super excited to test out. So we have a top coat that comes with this kit and it's called the Jealous Light. And let's see what we got here. Ooh. Okay, it is nice and thick. You all know that I really enjoy thick gels. That is like really thick. 
Yeah, it's really thick. I like it. So that's what that looks like. And we also have the Diva Express Press On Tip Gel, Tip Glue Gel. And this is a 15 ml bottle. This one is also a 15 ml bottle. Let's see what this looks like. Okay. It's interesting that the nail glue is a little bit looser than the top coat. I would expect the nail glue to be a little thicker. But um, yeah, this is what it looks like. It's a medium viscosity. Should still be easy enough to apply nail tips with. And the cool thing about this kit is that it does come with the gel color of your choice. So you can actually choose which gel color you want. Um, and so they actually sent me the Blue Raspberry Fudge, which is such a fun name. Oh my goodness. And yes, okay, it's a really pretty pastel blue, kind of a sky blue color really nice this one has also has a medium viscosity that it's interesting it feels like it's a really thin gel polish right but then when i do the drip test which is how i normally measure viscosity it's kind of a little bit of a slow drip so it's kind of a medium viscosity even though it feels like a thinner gel polish so yeah again this also is a 15 ml bottle i'm gonna go ahead and get this swatched for you guys okay wow well that's nice Yeah, that's really nice. Yeah, that's one coat coverage. These are really opaque. Wow. All right, I like it. And they self-level beautifully. Wow. At first, I didn't think it was going to be a one coater, but it definitely is. So I'm going to go ahead and cure that for 60 seconds. This is what two coats of the polish looks like. I'm going to go in with the in and out top coat. Very nice. It's really thick. And the top coat does say that it lasts up to 14 days. Two weeks of wear. And it does self-level nicely as well. Yeah, these products seem really easy to work with, so I'm going to go ahead and cure this for 60. So this is what the Blue Raspberry Fudge looks like. This is an absolutely beautiful color. And the top coat cured beautifully. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and figure out what nail design I want to do. And we'll get into a look. But I did go ahead and size out all of my nail tips from the Diva Express kit. When you all are sizing your nails out, you want to make sure that the nails fit sidewall to sidewall. So because I have some product on my nails, it's not going to reach my sidewall exactly. Um, but this is kind of how you want the nail to fit, okay? And so I did go ahead and size out all of my nail tips. I'm going to go ahead and apply two layers of my Oomt Peel Off Base Coat. Just apply two layers of my Peel Off Base Coat to my nails. I'm going to be applying them over, this is like three layers of gel polish and a top coat. I'm not ready to take that off just yet so I plan on popping this set off as soon as I'm done. For those who um, want to apply these to their natural nails for longevity, I do have a full nail prep video. Um, I'm going to link that down in the description box below but that's how you would prep your nails to get to this point for application. I only actually have th 30 minutes to do my nails so we're going to see how fast this uh, Gel X dupe works. Um, so I am going to use this lamp. Typically I like to use my rechargeable gooseneck lamp for applying my gel tips. But for the sake of this video and to really showcase all the products that come in the kit, um, I'm going to show you all how to do it with this type of lamp. Typically what I'll do is I'll tilt it to the side. And then when I turn it on, I'll be able to apply my nail tip and just hold it underneath the light like this. It's not that convenient for me because I've gotten used to doing it, you know, with my gooseneck lamp. But this is an alternative for those who don't have a gooseneck lamp. So I'm going to take a full cover tip here. Typically what you'll want to do is go in and itch, itch the inside of the full cover tip. It's not necessary to do, but it is helpful to get them to adhere. So I'm going to go ahead and do that really quick. Alrighty, so I have went ahead and etched all the tips for better adhesion. You'll want to take the press-on nail glue. So I'm going to take the press-on glue here. And what you want to do is you want to apply uh, you want to apply some to the inside of the nail, just kind of coating it. And then you will take a little bit here at the base. And that should be enough. You know, with each kit and each glue, it's a little bit different, but this is about how much I'll be using. And so again, with this particular lamp, I'm going to tilt it on its side and turn it on. And what you want to do first is you'll want to take the nail and you'll want to start at the cuticle and let the, the nail glue work its way down. And then you'll just hold it underneath the lamp like so. 
Okay, happy people. So while you are able to use the Jealous Light Lamp to apply your Gel X nails, um, I went ahead and pulled out my gooseneck lamp simply because I was pressed for time and wanted to kind of speed through this process. And so here you'll see me applying the rest of the tips using my gooseneck lamp. But I definitely wanted to show you all that it is possible to cure it with the lamp that comes with the kit as well. And I like that they use the coffin shaped nail tips because they're very versatile and so you can file and shape them into any shape that you would like. Okay, so after all the nails have been flash cured into place, now I'm gonna go in. Now I'm gonna go in with my jealous lamp and just fully cure them underneath here. Alrighty, so this is what all the nails look like after they've been cured. Next, what you'll want to do is go in and file off the tip of all the nails. So I'm gonna go through and do that really quick. Then I'm going to go through and buff the surface of all the nails. Okay, and if you all have any of the uh, nail glue that may have spilt out on your nails, you'll want to just kind of separate your skin from that nail glue. And then what you can do is you can go in with your drill. Alrighty, so this is what all the nails look like after they've been file shaped and buffed. I did go ahead and do my thumbnail off camera. Um, so yeah, overall the application isn't bad, but I do think that if this was like a gooseneck lamp or one of those lamps where you can kind of just slide your hand into, it would be a little bit easier to cure the product. But I think this is a really great lamp for being portable. So I am going to use this to cure the gel polish right now after I apply it. So next I'm going to go in with my blue raspberry fudge gel polish and apply that to all the nails. And this gel polish is really, really nice and opaque. It's definitely one coat coverage. What's interesting though is that, you know, you, this is my first time actually working with any Canadian nail products. But I will say that um, the quality of them are really nice. Um, the only thing I noticed about this gel polish is that it does kind of smell like paint like you know like regular paint that you would use to paint the walls that's what it kind of smells like but outside of that the coverage is great yeah it's beautiful and it self levels nicely as well Go ahead and cure this for 60 seconds. Alrighty, so this is what one coat of polish looks like. I'm gonna tap it. The lamp did a great job of curing the polish. I'm gonna go ahead and apply my second coat. This is what two coats of polish looks like. I am gonna go ahead and apply the Jealous Light in and out top coat. And I'm gonna apply that to all the nails. So I am going to be going in with stickers on the middle two nails, so I'm going to go ahead and cure that first. And then since I'll be going in with cuticle bling on these two nails, I'm going to apply the top coat separate. So I'm going to go ahead and go in with the bling really quick. This is the bling that I'm going to use. It's really cute and I feel like it matches the blue perfectly. I'm just going to go in with some simple cuticle bling. I like the fact that this top coat is really thick because I feel like when I want to go in with bling and such, like it's going to be like the the bling won't move around the rhinestones won't move around so I really like that that's perfect I'm gonna cure for 60 I'm gonna cure that for 60 Alrighty, so this is what the bling is looking like. I feel like because it's blue, you can kind of like barely see it, but it's still looking pretty cute nonetheless. Next, I'm gonna go in with some flowers. I have this sheet of 3D flowers that I've been dying to use. So I think I just wanna do like a flower on this nail and then a flower on this nail. Something like this. 
Yeah, okay, I'm gonna go ahead and apply this to the nails. This is gonna be a really quick, simple, easy design. Like so. I'm just gonna apply it to the nail like this. I kinda wanna look, make it look like the flowers are kind of meeting in the middle, if that makes sense. So then that's one half of it. And then I'm gonna use this side as the other half of the flower on the other nail. Like so. Oh yeah, that's pretty. So this is what the nails are looking like so far. I'm really liking how the 3D flowers look on the nails. So I think I wanna add some to the index and the ring finger as well. So this sticker here, I wanna add it to my pinky. And I wanna do it just above the bling, like so. Yeah, that's pretty, I like that. And then I'm gonna do the same thing on the index finger. I do apologize, you guys. My camera went out as I was applying the rest of my stickers, but yeah, this is how the nails are looking. I did go ahead and finish up the thumbnail off camera. So these are 3D nail art stickers. So I don't know if you all could tell that it's a little bit like raised off the nail, but I'm liking how it looks and it feels really nice as well. I was gonna go ahead and go in with top coat to ensure that the nails don't come off. That's something I actually would recommend if you all do plan on wearing these nails long term term but because I plan on popping these off within the next day or so I actually want to just like leave it as is and then see if you know how long those stickers actually last like if you can wear them you know with that texture to it so yeah I'm gonna go ahead and apply some cuticle oil and we're gonna get into the finished look okay all right you guys ain't she cute though yes I am loving how this beautiful pastel blue jelly -like set turned out I am absolutely feeling these 3d stickers this blue is absolutely gorgeous and the application was really easy let me know your thoughts on this Manny let me know if you like the stickers with or without top coat on them or if y'all think I should have did this this Manny matte I actually thought about doing a matte but I really wanted to showcase um, these products because they included a top coat so overall my thoughts on the diva express starter kit I think it's a really nice kit I love the fact that it comes with 600 nail tips it comes with a mini lamp it comes with a really phenomenal top coat this is a really nice top coat I like this a lot it even comes with the gel polish color of your choice and the nail tip glue the UV gel glue so overall I think it's a nice complete kit and not to mention it came with a file and some alcohol pads so it's a nice complete kit the only thing I would say is if you're trying to do gel X nails right I do think that this lamp is a little bit difficult to use to apply the nails again if you all use that hack where you kind of tilt it to the side and cure the nails it works um, but I do think there's other lamps out on the market that makes this process a little bit easier but this lamp is great for travel like if you want to do your nails on the go I actually travel a lot um, for work and just in general and so this lamp is something I think I will definitely be taking with me on the go um, I have one from another brand that I use all the time when I'm traveling so I think I'm gonna replace it with this one in my travel kit and so yeah you guys let me know have you all heard of this company I was especially impressed with the the gel polish as well it was one coat coverage it's a nice thing consistency but you know it delivers a nice bang for the color payoff if you all are interested in getting your hands on any of these products I do have a discount code with um, Fenera Cosmetics it is Rose 318 so if you all use that discount code at checkout you will have um, you will receive 10% off of your order also if you all are interested in getting these items separately so you don't have to get this whole kit you can buy the tip separate you can buy the lamp separate you can buy the gel polished the nail glue separate if you're all interested in getting it separately you can as well um, again this is my first time working with Canadian products and so far so good I do like them a lot and I'm looking forward to testing out even more of them in the future so I do want to give another special shout out to Fenera Cosmetics thank you all so much for being gracious enough to allow me to test out some of your products they are really nice I do upload every Tuesday Thursday and Saturday Thursdays in particular are my nail therapy Thursday premieres where I tune in live with you all as you watch me do my nails and if you all like what you saw here definitely Definitely stick around join the happy family I'd love to have you and as always you guys leave some love in the comments down below and I'll see you in my next video I hope you all have a wonderful awesome spectacular day bye